I am a chronic deal hunter, and there's nothing I hate more than feeling like I've spent more money than I should have. In this series, I aim to answer the question, should you cheap out? Today we're starting with wireless chargers. I've got in front of me the cheapest wireless charger with a stand that I could find. This is just a generic charger that's been rebranded for sale on AliExpress. There's nothing special about it. One of the other features that led me to this charger over others at the same price point was the advertised charging speed, but I have a feeling that the seller has stretched the truth just a little bit here. So let's open it up and see if this thing is really our fantasy, or if it's worth spending the money on a legit wireless charger. Included in the box is the wireless charger itself, which has no foam or anything holding it in place. There's a USB cable and some documentation, which is actually not in that broken of English. Let's open the charger itself. <laughs> I'm actually almost nervous. I'm always nervous when it comes to cheap electrical stuff and yeah, there you have it. So in the pictures, the base looked like it was made out of a decent solid plastic, but here this is the chintziest, flimsiest plastic I've ever felt. I almost immediately regret not going a step up to the $12 or $13 chargers, which have a solid base. Otherwise, it doesn't really look that bad. You can adjust the height to, well, whatever you need for your phone, and the USB cable just goes in the bottom here. There's not really going to be a clean way of putting the USB wire anywhere, so I think it's going to have to come out the side because you can't really fit the wire underneath and that's kind of a bad design choice. But overall, I mean, if it works, I'll be happy. Let's just leave it at that. Okay, so good news, I'm back a little bit later and it's definitely charging my phone. Thing is, it's not really a fast charge. It's about one amp, which is a standard charging cable. That means your average smartphone will charge in approximately three hours. There's a little tiny light on the side which shows whether it's charging or not charging but you can't see it at all from the front and it's practically invisible even in the dark. The nice thing about this one is, since you can adjust the height of the coil, once you've got it lined up to your phone, it will continue to work every time you place your phone down. You won't have to readjust it unless you accidentally move. The idea is there, but the execution is just not that great. The plastic on the stand is so cheap and I think I already stripped the screw that holds it in place, so really, again, I do wish I'd spent a little bit extra to get something with a solid base instead of this, you know, flimsy mess. So for wireless chargers, you can cheap out, but don't go as cheap as possible. I'd suggest getting something in the mid-range from a reliable brand like Anchor or Aki or someone recognizable who's not just selling cheap crap. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below.